are so easy class today. Today we are going to be making a washable, reusable, recycled dust cover. So I got this from the dollar store and it had a great, you know, dust, um, a duster on it and I utilized it a lot. I love these the the fleece of them and the um the little fibers that they have on them really pick up a lot of dust so i thought we could recreate it i'm using some scraps you've seen this fabric before when we made the headbands this is now i'm using um the camouflage but we'll still know there's dirt on there i'm just saying so Stick with me and I'll show you how to do this easy, easy project. The first thing you need to do is cut two pieces of fleece that are 10 inches long by seven inches wide. And then two pieces of the same fleece or whatever fleece scraps you have, and they will be 10 inches long by five inches wide. All right, this one looks like it's actually six. So go ahead and do six, you could do five. We want these varied in uh, levels so that you're not just getting one level of dust, but that you've got a lot of the little fibers coming out. And then three used dryer sheets. These are gonna be perfect. All right, now I need you to stack everything together but you're going to start with one of your smallest so the six by ten then a dryer sheet then a seven by ten another dryer sheet seven by ten again dryer sheet and then your last six by ten it's making quite a sandwich here it's quite thick and fluffy and um, once we get this all sewn up, if you can picture this, so I'm going to go up and around where this is at. I'm going to use some pins to pin a little path and I'll sew up and around so that all I'll have to do when I'm ready to use it is slide this up in. You can see that I have pinned it. It doesn't have to be perfect. If you wanted to make a chalk line, you could, but I'm just going up and around and back down so that I can just slide this in. Let's get sewing. You can see that I have pinned it. It doesn't have to be perfect. If you wanted to make a chalk line, you could, but I'm just going up and around and back down so that I can just slide this in. Let's get sewing. So I'm checking to see if this fits and I'm not happy with how easily this is coming out. So I am going to go in just a little bit closer here so that, I mean, there's some give to the fabric. So I think I can go a little closer. The beauty of making something like this is that you can just kind of figure out if if it's going to work for you or not. Oh, that's so much better. Yeah, that's not going to come off while I'm dusting. All right, let's move on to the next step. This is probably the easiest part. You want to have a really good pair of scissors. And then you're just going to cut every, oh, three quarters of an inch or so into your seam. And since we have a double seam, if you hit that first one, it's not gonna make a big difference. But let's go all the way around this. Well, we did it. Wasn't that easy? So you can see that I did kind of go with the same, um, this, I cut the fleece the same way that my sewing went in that nice arch. Look at all that. It's like, it's like reeking dust already. 
<laughs> just kidding. I think it's maybe some fibers. These little, um, the little dryer sheets, they are so well known for collecting dust. So happy dusting. And I hope that you enjoyed our so easy class today. Um, look, I'm going to be able to just take this, toss it in the washer. You're welcome. Have a great day.